Y'all know what we're talking about today, right? Y'all already know the shit that we're talking about. Motherfucking Mike Tyson fought Jake Paul. Jake Paul fought Mike Tyson. Y'all, this is a fight that I honestly could not have anticipated if I wanted to. I knew probably where it was going to go because as much as I love Mike Tyson, as much as I enjoyed his boxing fights and all that shit, he's still an older gentleman, bro. He's not Iron Mike Tyson anymore. Simply as that. For Jake Paul to challenge Mike to a fight, he should know that he's not in his prime. Jake Paul should be fighting people that are actually, you know, able to genuinely fight. Mike Tyson is a stronger fighter than most. Mike Tyson is a stronger man than most men at 58. I mean, the people I know that are at 58 are, like, decrepit and, like, decaying. So, I don't know. I just feel like Jake Paul probably... I don't know, man. The fight is a really hard thing to digest because everybody's hoping that Mike Tyson would win unrealistically, of course. Mike Tyson could... I mean, Mike Tyson did what he does, and he fucking survived for the whole round. That did what he does. I misspoke. I misspoke. But he survived the rounds. Um, he stuck out through all of the rounds, and he was fine. He didn't even look hurt after all of it. But it genuinely... It's not a surprise. It's not a surprise that Mike Tyson lost. It's a disappointment. But it's not surprising. And I think that that this was kind of a sign that the crown that Mike Tyson has worn is being passed over to Jake Paul now. If Jake Paul can even fucking get close to some of the insanely crazy good boxers that um, are in, in the fray at the moment. Uh, I'm not too familiar with boxing at the moment. I haven't been keeping up with it. I haven't been watching it. As much as I like fighting, I've just kind of been sticking to myself, you know. <gasps> Sorry, it's like one in the morning right now. Um, but yeah, it's it's a shame Mike Tyson lost. But it's also, I really, really hope that this was his last fight. Because uh, Mike Tyson transitioning over to uh, retirement and just living regularly. I hope he continues training because working out is, you know, it's good for everybody. The camera doesn't make me look that great at the moment and neither does the shirt. But, you know, I, I got a little, got a little, a little muscle, a little bit. Oh, yeah. Got some flabby on me. <laughs> but, um... No, actually, though, I, I really hope Mike Tyson goes into the um, next era of his life, and I hope that that's retirement, and I hope he lives a long, happy life. Um, him boxing, that's not going to help him do that. But, um, yeah, so um, just wanted to let y'all know, if you haven't seen the fight, there's probably going to be some clips or something of it um, and whatnot. This, I don't even know why this was so important to me. I just really wanted to see it and I really wanted to witness possibly one of the biggest boxing matches in fucking history I mean yeah probably the biggest boxing match in history but um y'all that's gonna be it for this one I'll have to see you in the next one and um yeah that's gonna be it see ya oh you know what I actually might do some MMA reviews see if I can get my two cents in on it but uh yeah see ya